Hey guys, Penguin Recordings here, and today I'm redoing the Left 4 Dead 2 comparison video. People asked me to use the source demo and remove the screen recorders, so I did that just I did just that this time around. The video quality will be less because I'm using a camera instead. So we're starting both off, both games off at above 280 region. Windows 290, Ubuntu is 28. Uh, the fluctuations make it really hard to see. 290 for a good bit there on Windows, while well, Ubuntu is at 280. Both still well above 100 frames per second. Ubuntu is slightly dipping. Oh, they're both now dipping into the 100 region. Now without the screen recorders pushing the games, the frames can really soar high. But it also makes it a whole lot difficult to see because they jump up and down pretty fast. In this area, they're still running relatively the same on both systems. Within the 120 to 160 region there on both operating systems. Okay, for a second we're seeing... Oh, Windows is above 200. Oh, Ubuntu went above 200 just now. As soon as we look at this door, yeah, they'll both jump up to 200. As soon as the area rendering becomes less. Both still at the 100 mark with all this action. Oh, for a second there, Windows dropped down to 90. That was the first drop into the 90 region. Oh, again. Still above 120 for both systems. So far, so good. The fire here, for some reason, has no problem on the Ubuntu side. There's just a fire in the stairs area. Alright, both jumping back up to 200 for a second just now. As you can see, the fluctuations are anywhere from 100 up to 200 frames per second. So what we're really looking for is when it dips down below 100. Still waiting to see it drop below 100 on either system. Both seem to be operating in the same capabilities right now. Alright, here we're going to see a dip in Ubuntu. Uh, about 160 FPS versus Windows 210. That's the only place it seems to do that. Oh, both dropped to 90 there. Uh, I dropped the puke and more zombies came. Yep, both dropping to the 90s region here. Oh, for a second Windows was at the 80s region. I don't know why Windows is dropping less. But it's only by 10 frames per second, so that's okay. This fire here, for some reason, Windows and Ubuntu perform exactly the same. While well, that stairs fire still is different. So far, the same. And both dropped 90. Yep, both dropped to 90. I think for a second, Windows is 80, but it's too short. Both are dropping at certain times, less than they should, but they drop for too short a period of time to really call it a performance difference. So that's it for this test. As you guys can see, the game performs relatively the same on both platforms. Alright, so we're done with those tests. Now I have a bonus test here. I wanted to see how would Ubuntu perform if we removed Unity and instead used a lighter DE such as LXDE. Alright, that's the only thing that's changed this time around on Ubuntu side. We've changed the DE to LXDE. The Windows test is the exact same test with Unity. No difference there. It's the same video. So the only difference will be that the LXD test will be a new video. So the LXD test is on the left while uh, Windows 8 is on the right. Windows 8 will experience all the same drops again because it is the same video. What I want to see here is does Ubuntu with LXDE experience the same drops or is able of, to achieve higher frames per second. So right off the bat, Windows has a higher frames per second while LXDE is staying at about 270. Uh, just, it looks like it's trying to reach 280. It did, but stayed at 270 for the most part. So that was a good 20 frames per second difference there at the beginning. Here, Windows is owning it by about 40 frames per second. Now they're both dropping. It seems that LXDE doesn't have as much spiking as Windows or Ubuntu with Unity. That's a good thing, I, I suppose. It means smoother frames. 
Looking about the same in this area. Oh, slightly higher on LXDE. We're seeing about 20 frames higher a bit there. It's now 160 versus Windows 120. About similar performance here. This is using exactly the same demo on both sides. Oh, Windows is higher while X LXD is lower. Windows reached 200 just, uh, just now. So LXD was not able to reach the 200 area just now as well. Okay, let's see if it drops to 90 here. We know that Windows does. And we're about to see the drop in a couple of seconds. Okay, Windows drop and nope. LXD was staying at about 140. Wow, it's actually staying slightly higher under the heavy scenes here. That's right, a good 40 frames per second that. higher. Oh, That's when the fire comes in, Windows owns it about 20 frames per second difference. Oh, they're falling back to the same. Both 200 area right now. Fluctuating. Ever so slightly, it seems that when the action happens with the zombies, LSDE has a slightly higher frame rate. But then when we go into the effects such as fire, then Windows has better frame rate. Another good place to check would be that stairs fire. I, I, Windows seems to have a higher frame per second there. Let's see if LXDE can help. Nope, it doesn't seem to be. So LXD still performs the same here as Ubuntu with Unity. Windows has a higher frame rate when it comes to that fire under the stairs. Oh, Windows drops 90 here, but LXDE still remains higher. So LXD in this area of the game is still higher than Ubuntu Unity itself. So where Windows 8 and Ubuntu Unity dropped to 90, LXDE was able to remain at about 140 frames per second. This fire area seems to be similar with Windows experience. Oh, Windows was higher for a moment there, 190. Oh, Windows dropped there, but LXDE did not. It's looking like LXDE has a slight performance improvement over... Whoa! Okay, that part there just now, Windows dropped to 90, but LXDE seems to maintain a higher frame rate again. So I guess it really does make somewhat of a difference if you use a lighted UE. Not by much, that fireplace under the stairs is still an uh, annoyance. Windows has a higher frame rate there. But when the zombies come into play, it looks like LXDE is able to handle the load better. So that was a small test, not representative of what the entire community experiences, just what I experience. Please understand that. So if you were looking to squeeze out a couple more frames per second from Ubuntu, give LXDE a go. But if you are content with Unity, then it does just fine and it is relatively the same with Windows 8. Hopefully in the future, we may just see NVIDIA drivers become better on Ubuntu, but that's for the future to see. I hope you guys enjoyed this and please forgive me for any mistakes I had. Thanks for watching guys.